for people who, who don't know about Tibetan medicine, what is like for you the most fascinating thing? Mm, well, yeah, maybe people they don't know about uh, Tibetan medicine, but everyone is thinking about their health, you know. And uh, especially many people they think about their health in a more natural way. So I think in this case, Tibetan medicine is a very good method to help them to how to maintain a natural health. You know, of course, Tibetan medicine not only taking the pills or medicines. You know, Tibetan medicine talks about uh, the perfect way of living, lifestyle, and good diet, and uh, also we offer a lot of external therapies. And uh, that's why, yeah, Tibetan medicine is a very good, uh, how do you say, natural method which promotes uh, good health, mentally, physically, and energetically. So you're talking about good health. So do you have some advices for people how they can stay healthy for, like, in the old age to get old, healthy? Mm, yeah. Uh, as I said, you know, it's very important. Tibetan medicine, we are talking about uh, four important uh, ways to keep our health. And first is the, um, a good diet. Very important. So good diet means what we eat and how we eat, how much we eat and when we eat or also drink, right? So I think that kind of concept is very important. And today, you know, some people, so here we talk about uh, organic food, biological food and so on, quite often. I think this is a good news, somehow it's increasing more and more, you know, awareness about uh, natural food and so on. But somehow people are still, they don't know like uh, how much they eat and when they eat and how they eat and these things. So Tibetan medicine offers many information about these things. And then about uh, lifestyle, so according to Tibetan medicine also very important. And um, so when we talk about lifestyle today, people say, oh, you know, I'm going to the gym like twice a week or three times a week. I do sport, I do yoga. You know, it's not, not something like that simple. Lifestyle means uh, the way how you live and, uh, you know, the, the, the regularity, what you do in your life. Actually, I like this Tibetan medicine way, how it's presented about lifestyle. The lifestyle, we call it the routine lifestyle, it, it refers to what we do in 24 hours, you know, right? And uh, then um, in this, uh, for example, of course, our exercise movement, all these things are important. Another thing very important is like, uh, uh, you know, to get more sleep, for example. Very few people, they think that sleep is an important part of lifestyle. According to Tibetan medicine, this is very important. Sometimes I think the sleep is even more important than sport, you know. So that kind of thing, routine uh, lifestyle, what we do in 24 hours, and then how we can have uh, also better social lifestyle and uh, spiritual lifestyle. And then there is another one, it's called uh, like, uh, how do you say, seasonal lifestyle mm -hmm. and uh, uh, temporary lifestyle and so on. There are many things. I think these things are very, very important information for today, you know. So we should not think when we say Tibetan medicine, uh, okay, let's take some herbs and that's it. You know, it's, it's much more than the, the, the herbs and so on. And then uh, also we talk about external therapies. So in Tibetan medicine we talk about typology and pathology. So why we talk about the typology, that's about prevention, how to prevent the disease, you know. It's a very important aspect. And then first we talk about typology, and second we talk about uh, pathology. If someone is sick, then we, how we can help them, right? And then we have to use different medicines and herbs and these things. And plus uh, also working with diet, lifestyle and external therapies. And uh, my personally, the, today, like, I think it's important that we focus, you know, normally we call it four method, but now I'm saying we should add extra one, that's called the spiritual uh, method. I think to do yoga, meditation, you know, this kind of natural way of relaxation and these things are also very important.